what's up guys it's your boy og two here so basically i'm going to be doing a little review on the quad comp from strike industries um i got this not that long ago basically i got it for 60 to 70 bucks uh, i got it off of optics planet um i've purchased from them before i've had good i guess stuff i guess like in terms of delivery uh the speed uh for me i guess the items come pretty quick they definitely don't take that long at least for me um i know they have had some bad uh like people had bad experiences with them in the past but as of now it seems like they're doing pretty good so i do recommend buying from them of course you know check out the prices see how it compares to other people or from the company themselves you know what i mean so yeah basically this is the box guys um micro threaded comp quad i call it quad comp <laughs> so yeah that's just how i see it there's the picture of the of the comp right there it has like two stripes i guess and then one on the far left um this is the logo of the strike industries um or is it this way it's one of one of those ways <laughs> for the logo um this is the side it shows you as well the the comp um it says uh micro uh, compensator that can work with just about any size slide using threaded barrel half inch by 28 uh so just keep that in mind threads per inch um so yeah if you want to pause it you can you know read it up to you this is the back it also shows the comp and it says up there um let me see oh you're right there um let's say baffling uh redirects gas to mitigate felt recoil and reduce muzzle rise as you can see the gases will come out through the side the slits of the comp um of course this is looking from the top angle you know the top view of it um this is the bottom like a qr code i guess you could scan uh what else some more information warning if you want to pause that and read that <laughs> that's up to you um yeah nothing much to it the box is kind of small but of course it is just a comp um let me see is the thing in here it does come with a tool let me see to tighten it oh yeah here we go wait is it in there it comes with a little card maybe it's in here let's see Oh yeah, it's right there. Here, I'll pull it out for you guys. So this is the tool you'll be using basically to tight tighten it. Um, there is an actual tool to tighten it, but to tighten it to the correct spec. So, you know, that's the reason why I also haven't took it to the range. It's not uh, tightened to the correct spec that it's supposed to be. So, you know, keep that in mind as well before you use it um of course if you want to use it like that that's up to you but i wouldn't recommend it you know you want to make sure everything's put on properly and stuff like that so yeah now let's get to it so this is my canic tp9 elite sc and of course as you know this is the quad comp from strike industries um you know i bought it not just for the looks but for the function of it you know to help of course with the recoil you know so you know to each their own on why you buy it um i bought it for both <laughs> like i said aesthetics and performance um it looks nice at least i think so on my canic hopefully you guys think so as well Here, let me show you this way this is basically the full look let's get a closer look so basically it has some slits on the side where the gas is you know basically they go out those way you know both ways through the side um it says mcq micro micro uh i don't know why i can't tell guys i'm so sorry micro uh comp and then the q i'm assuming it stands for quad so yeah has some more lettering at the bottom uh this is the top view basically how you seen it on the box and the gases escape through the sides you know like i said to mitigate uh recoil and stuff a little bit from the side i don't want to point it at you guys um this is the bottom you know 
and of course i am thinking of replacing this olight with another olight but maybe the pl valkyrie 3s because it's a more full size like a uh longer flashlight and i think it'll look better aesthetically you know so yeah and of course for the function it's still a flashlight so it's gonna do what i need it to do uh here let me show you guys on the other side here you go as you can see it says uh says 40 uh, inch you know the pounds so like i said there is a certain tightness you need to tighten it you know for the you know to the correct spec so like i said keep that in mind you want it to be fully on there correctly not too tight and obviously not too loose you know so yeah and that's the other side of the of the comp you know where the slits are where you tighten it and of course just the bottom again nothing too crazy okay and uh one more thing i will also show you i literally just forgot <laughs> Basically, there's nothing in the mag. There's nothing in the chamber. It's empty. I will dry fire. Don't recommend it. I do it. Um, I don't know. That totally went over my head. I forgot all about that. Um, of course, I do have this mag over here that's loaded, but it's not in the pistol. You know, it's all off to the side. I have an empty mag in there just so, you know, no one worries or anything like that. So, yeah. Let me see. Let me stand it up for you guys. Oh, that's kind of slipping. Put it right there, I guess. So basically, yeah, guys, that's um basically my build. But like I said, I do want to finish it um, with a different O light on there. Uh, let me know, guys, down below. Would you buy this comp? Are you thinking about it? Have you purchased it? How much did you buy it for? Do you like it? Do you enjoy it? Um, you know, you might be helping somebody else out as well. Um, thank you for all the subscribers. You know, right now I'm at 403, I believe. You know, slowly but surely it's going up. Um, I'm trying to hit that 500 and then that 1K mark. You know, it's it's a process. But, yeah, thank you guys. Um, like, comment, subscribe, uh, share. You know, there's people who do share, so I do appreciate that. You know, and uh, hopefully, you know, this helped out in some way um hopefully i could give more information once i take it to the range so yeah thank you guys for watching og two tone out